quite good enough. Everything is too far away. Had the ramp, though. So I'll stream Friday night and Saturday night on the front page, U.S. time zones. Of course, I'll be streaming. Uh, I want to finish a run of this tonight, Jeff, so probably another couple hours. Go! I'll be on for quite some time. Yeah, it's exclamation point ACCF. Good try, Fire. Thank you. Yeah, I reset based on the town. That command that texted exclamation point ACCF. Uh, that tells you what I'm looking for on the maps. And you can keep track of the maps each time they show up. Uh, and what I'm looking at. You can keep track of those in the top right corner of the stream. I've got a screenshot of them. As they pop up each time. Hmm. Okay. Not great. Um, the town hall is really, really bad. But so these chores will probably be about twelve fifty-five at best. I honestly shouldn't take this, but there are there's a house pretty close to Nooks. There's multiple villagers around that house, so that's good for flea checks. Um, so that's why I'm taking this right now. The one problem villager is that dude to the bottom right. He's very hard to get to from from uh, Nook's cranny. Doesn't really matter, aim, because I can't know beforehand. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're already in place, just because it's the day of Easter, so they were loaded in. They were loaded in when I loaded the town in, per se. So yeah, they're already here. You can see them everywhere. And I'm pretty sure they're already, like, they're already, like, predetermined, yeah, which one is a sticker and which isn't. Got Oliver with his bathhouse, a.k.a. Harry. Scoop! Mm, this is going to be a very bad, very, very bad intro. <laughs> I have to go around the entire town like three times. Ugh, this is sucky. Thank you, ceiling cat. I wish the town hall could be closer, man. This would That would make this town pretty dang good, but... Town hall chose violence. Town Hall chose violence. Walker, you walked into the screen. I love that. Oh, I love that, dude. Why did he just walk into the screen? It's so perfect. Now I have to keep this run because he's the best. He's so cute. Gibson Ridge. What the heck is that? <laughs> I can't remember what Gibson Ridge is off the top of my head. Is that GR2? I don't even know it by that name. Uh, I used Radar Scope. I've had Radar Scope for a very long time. Before that, I used Storm Radar. But that doesn't work anymore. So, can't use Storm. He wow. We want dirty villagers. Exactly. You're right. You're right. Porsche too. Wow. Brenda. I forgot it was called Gibson Ridge. Honestly, nobody calls it Gibson Ridge. So I just did, I didn't even put it. I didn't put two and two together. Oh wow, she's cute. 
fucking dope, man. All right, we got a ton of cracks down here, dang it. And tangy. Dude, come on. You can't say that this town isn't, like, goaded villager-wise. This town is absolutely goaded, villagers. <laughs> They're so good. It's just got a crappy town hall. That's the only problem. These are really, some really solid villagers. I mean, just ignore Harry, right? And then the rest of them are fine. Sorry, any Harry fans in the chat? I'm sorry. She was the one. She was the one. <laughs> she was the one for you, huh? There for you. So cute. So true. Gross. Gross beginning. Gross, gross, gross. Did get a shovel at least, so there is that. Now it's all down to the chores. Although, not a single chore I would really reset for. They're all good. They're all at least semi decent. I don't want to see Portia. Portia would be the worst one. I don't want to see Harry either, if I could help it. But the others are good. I want to see Scoot. I want to see Walker. Tangy is okay. I don't really want to see her. How did I pick those up? You want to explain that? No idea how I picked those up. <laughs> what the heck, man? Been perfect. Perfect first chore. Yeah, these chores are probably not going to be sub-13 minutes. Ah, uh, that's so unfortunate, man. Really wish I could make him that, but yeah. With those slow intros and the having to run all the way to the town hall, I'm definitely, definitely going to fall behind here. Real housewives. Okay, also the second closest villager, but she's inside, so not as good, but that'll do. It's a good second chore. We'll have to see who the third chore is and then go from there. We got three cracks. How many cracks on the way to the town hall? Another crack there, another one there. One down there, we can't get that. One... So I saw five. That might not be good enough, though. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Red? Hmm, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Depends on the third chore. If I, if I see Scoot for the third chore, I'll be pretty happy, but basically a 1 and 4. There's a crack up there. Basically a 1 and 4 to get a, a villager that I'm happy with, because Scoot is the only one left that's actually decent. Tangy is okay, but she's far away. So let's see what Nook does. Scoot in the town. Yes. All right, I got Tangy. <laughs> All right, let's see what the damage is. At least she's Tangy. That's true. We get to go see Tangy. So at least there's that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Mantis moment. Oh man. Guys, this kind of, uh, it gets a little exhausting to stream three days in a row on the front page and constantly be thinking of things to talk about. Quite honestly, I'm pretty happy with the front page streams and I'm ready to go back, but and we can uh, we can all enjoy the the niche streams and the club here after we've gotten all the the interested people off the front page. Um, I appreciate all of you, by the way. So you're really interested in these runs, these Nintendo speed runs, or weather, or anything like that. I'm here for it. But we got two more front page days after this, and I'm just gonna be like, oh my goodness. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go ham two more days. So it's gonna be a lot, but I, I believe in it. And then we get to return to our little, our little hideout corner. <laughs> Kiki. Yep, I told you this town has really goaded villagers. Literally Walker and Kiki right next to him. Walker could be the one to give me a flea this run, which would be sick. And, uh, there's also Portia, there's also Tangy, and Scoot. Like, this- this town has goaded villagers. So yeah, that's the- that's the plan. That's the idea. I appreciate all of you who are here today. We've watched in and out of the stream. Hope you found something interesting. But yeah, like I, I'm, I'm. Oh my god, dude! I'm so brain dead. I'm going into the town hall like an idiot. All right, that's a solid 14 seconds of time loss for no reason. <laughs> RNG manip right there. Alright, these aren't even going to be sub-1330 chores. That's almost worth a reset. So let's see if these uh, cracks are any good. Let's see if the cracks are good. If the cracks are good, we can make it happen. But I kind of goofed up on these chores a bit. My brain ain't working properly. I'm still really enjoying the runs. What's up, Sloking? Flawless copy. Ooh, nice. Mint condition. But then you put it in the Wii and scratched it up, right? Because you wanted to play it. <laughs> yeah, City Folk is an incredible game. I see. I've tried to find the appeal of having, like, perfect condition things before, but quite honestly, that's not really up my... That's not really up my alley. It's not how I... Like, I like to collect things. I'm more of a plushy collector. I wouldn't want them to have stains or anything on them, but... I don't need to have, like, every single disc or anything in just the best condition possible. Which is fair. Like, I understand those who do. Those who benefit from that more. Or they like to do that. But I like... I appreciate different perspectives like that. Alright, let's see if it's five eggs. Is at least six. <laughs> Is 
Seven. Seven. Good job, Pikmin. The only person who guessed. And they got it right. 100% chat success ratio. City Folk's expensive at the moment? Oh, man. Yeah, I bought a Japanese version to play it again. I don't know how much it is. <laughs> My favorite candy? It's a great question. I really, really, really like sour gummy worms. And my my all-time favorite candy tied with that are cherry sours. Very specific, uh, very specific candy. So cherry sours and sour gummy worms. Those are my favorites. You got 12 bags of them? That's the good stuff. I wasn't sure if I did it. Couldn't remember if I talked to him enough times. Yep, I love me some sour gummy worms. If you haven't had cherry sours either, those are the bomb too. Sometimes I think those are my favorite. It's a good one though, Steve. -um. Chicken noodle soup is... Honestly, I don't like chicken noodle soup that much. It's not my favorite thing. It could be made really well, but... Like, if it's spiced up, like, if it's actually seasoned a lot and maybe spicy, then, I, then I'm okay with it, but otherwise, I don't really like chicken noodle soup. It has to be, like, it's gotta be, like, done, like, uh, I don't know, freaking make it, make it, like, Cajun style or, or, like, roast style or something like that. Just, it has to be more interesting. Are cherry sours lemon heads? No. Cherry sours are... Look up Sather's cherry sours. That's what they are. So they're specifically chewy candies. Yeah, trolley gummy worms. Those are ones they usually have, but I like all sorts of gummy worms. So you could probably imagine that I really like... Um, if I'm gonna get um, some ice cream or something, I really like dirt and worms. The, that's some of my favorite ice cream slash pudding slash whatever. Dirt and worms is amazing. Huge dirt and worms fan. Cause it's got the gummy worms. I like sweet and sour gummy worms. <laughs> All right, now we start up the run here. Not a brilliant run by any means, but um, we get to upgrade Nook's shop here and uh, set up our flowers. Sorry, I forgot about reset. You skip. <laughs> Never noticed them? They are kind of like... They don't really stand out that much. They look kind of... Unenjoyable, honestly. I think... Most people think that, um... Most people think that cherry sours are probably like... Medicinally tasting or something like that when they first see them. So they don't really notice them, but... They're a hidden jewel because of that. A hidden gem. In my opinion. Sorry about Automod. I got you, I got you. Automod for the front page. Weather question? Sure. If you read below in panels below my stream, you can see that I tell you to ask any weather questions you've got. I'm always, always, always open for weather questions. Feel free to send them. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, we got Cookie, too? Dude, this is so freaking cool. My favorite weather element? What specifically are you referring to as an element? Like a, a topic or, or what? Cookie. Porsche, Walker, Tangy, Geeky, Scoop, 
This map is epic, dude. Okay, so it's a topic. Gotcha. My favorite weather topic to cover? Uh, I guess it depends on how exactly I'm covering it. If I'm talking about it casually amongst friends, or if I'm, you know, live streaming, live streaming coverage about it. Um, I, I've always been, I'm, I'm just a severe weather, I'm a severe weather dude, so I usually go down the route of lightning and tornadoes. I'm pretty big on lightning. I like lightning a lot. But, uh, tornadoes always satisfy. You know, tornadoes are like, so, I, I hate roller coasters, right? And weather suits my fancy. So I get my adrenaline fill from things like storm chasing. I don't like roller coasters. I don't want to be on a roller coaster. Don't want to experience it. I don't... I don't like that sort of... A, that's not what gives me adrenaline. That just, you know, would make me crap my pants. I don't want to do that. Don't want to be on them. <laughs> but uh, my adrenaline would come from chasing storms. And seeing storms. Being out in the field like that. That's the good stuff. You're sorry, live what? <laughs> what are we living? This is interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and plant these right here. Development of supercells? Yeah, I can talk about that. Kiki, get out of the way. Speaking of potatoes, you crave one of Wendy's baked potatoes. Oh, damn. I don't think I've ever had a Wendy's baked potato. I think I've seen it before. I think I've seen it on DoorDash, actually. That's where I saw it. But I've only looked at Wendy's on DoorDash, like, one time. I don't really get DoorDash. I don't really get Wendy's anymore. And the reason is, I kind of had my fill of Wendy's. There was a Wendy's, uh, basically across the street from my old apartment in North Carolina when I was doing- when I was an undergrad. So, I got Wendy's quite often because of that, and I just don't- I just, don't desire them any longer, you know? Which is weird, right? You'd think that... You'd think that, um... If I go to Wendy's often, I would probably discover what I really want to eat from there. And therefore, I'd probably develop cravings for that occasionally, but... Nope, not really. <laughs> that sounds terrible, North. Yeah, I don't think, uh... I don't think I want to do that either. Quite honestly, no. I won't do that either. I like Ferris wheels a lot, though, but Ferris wheels have seat belts, or... Or you're not on a good Ferris wheel. <laughs> I bet it's a really good menu item, though, Slow King, because... Um, it's hard to really have... I mean, the toppings that you would put on a, a baked potato, I guess, would be processed, but the potato itself is not really processed food. It's not, like, as processed as almost everything else that Wendy sells. So the baked potato, I mean, it's, you just got a nice fluffy potato. It's not really processed. <laughs> Interesting. Maybe one day I'll try it. One day I'll try the Wendy's baked potato. Uh, but there is a, there is an exception to the rule. I, I really like Wendy's chili, so... If I'm ever gonna get anything from Wendy's, I'm gonna have Wendy's chili. That's just gonna... That's just how it is. <laughs> so Wendy's chili is my guilty pleasure, I suppose. Favorite snack? Um, chips and salsa.
Chips and salsa, easy. Which salsa, though? That's a good question. I just like trying all the salsas. It's interesting you work for Wendy's, though. I have a cousin that manages a Wendy's. Or used to, at least. I don't think he does anymore. But I never... I, I didn't learn too much about the inner mechanisms. Unreasonably priced? I do think their prices went up a lot most recently, yeah. Their rewards app is pretty okay as well. It's got some things sometimes that make it worth... But yeah. There... Oh, got the hybrid. Let's go. I forgot to take this red rose out of my mouth, too. Alright! Hybrid down. Very good. Good early hybrid. This run might be worth it, guys. Three out of six axes. I think we might have a run. We might have a run here. This might be good. Kit Kat or Milky Way? Oh. Probably Milky Way. How did City Trial go? I finished two runs of City Trial any percent. One was one hour and 29 seconds. So just barely not sub hour. And it lost, it was a, an incredible speed run. Um, actually was matching world record pace until I didn't get Destruction Derby 2. Six times in a row. Which lost eight, 18 minutes. And since the Destruction Derby 2 is a 50-50, uh, that was a 1 out of 64 chance to have it just not show up six times in a row. 2 to the 6th. So that was great. And then the run after that, I got a 53 minute time. I was like, damn, sub 55? So I was pretty happy with that. So I, I checked off another thing that I wanted to do for the front page, which is get a, a nice city trial any percent time. I'm pretty happy with the 53 minute city trial time. Although, I guess if I really wanted to extrapolate how good uh, the underflow glitch is, I would probably try to get a sub 50. I'll have both north. I like milk chocolate. I like dark chocolate. The only thing I don't like is white chocolate. Not not a huge white chocolate fan. Alright, we're four out of seven axes right now. Pace! This could be the good pace right here. Nook keeps giving me the axes, man. We have the hybrid, then all we need is the coconut. We're next to two villagers right outside the house, so just one day they need to come outside and have a flea. That's it. And then bam, we're on our way. It isn't chocolate? Yeah, exactly. Because it isn't chocolate. I think it is actually. I actually don't know anything about it. Let's go, Nook. Keep doing it. Oil and fake, fake cocoa. Five out of eight. This is a good run. So white chocolate technically more unhealthy. <laughs> That's true, North. I am a big dark chocolate fan, though. I'll, I'll have basically anything that's 83% or less. I don't really like the super dark chocolate, like 90%. 83 is okay, and then everything above that is really good, too. I'm a dark chocolate fan. One time, I had unsweetened chocolate, and then I was like... That's disgusting. And I'm kind of glad it didn't ruin chocolate in general for me. Or at least dark chocolate in general. Because, yeah, having that 100%, that was not good. Six out of nine axes, by the way. Nice. 69. You've eaten straight up cocoa beans. I'd try it. Although it'd probably just taste the same, wouldn't it? 
You make sake? Nice. I gotta try more sakis. I've only had a couple of them. There's an Asian pear sake I had once that was incredibly good. Can we get 7 of 11? We're on our way. We just need to go 1 for 2, guys. And then we will get some slushies today. We will have some slushies tonight if we go 7 11. Welcome back without potato Wi Fi, Nat. I'm so happy to have you back. What was it that was causing it, actually? Nothing made it less overpowering? Goodness gracious. Alright, 7 of 10. Ooh, man. I really like this run right now. I'm sorry, if I get an axe on the next day, it will be 8 of 11 and not 7 of 11, so we won't get slushies, but just bear with me, because that means the run's really good. The Airbnb had Wi-Fi. Oh, you were on a family trip. <laughs> Gosh. Well, I hope you had headphones or, or earphones so that I didn't... I didn't disturb your your friends or family. Your family, sorry. You just said you were on a family trip. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying here. Man's going to Costa Rica and eating cocoa beans. That's more than touching grass. Well, yeah, you gotta bake with unsweetened. Yeah, but just eating it straight up is dummy... Dummy thick. You got your own room? Poggers. All right, we get we get slushies. Seven Eleven, guys. What flavor slushy do you want? This round's on me. We get slushies today. Let's go. <laughs> Slurpy moment. It's been a while since we've gone to Seven Eleven. Sour watermelon. I'm most interested probably in trying the white cherry. Mimicking like that, the Gatorade white cherry flavor. I wonder how close to Gatorade white cherry it tastes. I haven't had Gatorade in so long, because it's kind of just... Kind of just not that great. <laughs> I don't know, are y'all Gatorade haters too? Am I allowed to speak Gatorade hate? It's not really that great. <laughs> I think the white cherry is still good. Wow, look at that, man. 75% access. This is a good run. That means there's no coconut. 8 out of 12 axes and the hybrid. There's no way. There's no way there's a coconut. Okay, that or the axes are trash. Alright, get ready for a catharsis. If you need a cathartic moment, here you go. Enjoy the deforestation. In the desertification of a climate in real time. I hope you're doing well, KRS, by the way. You like Gatorade and Powerade? What's up, Derp and Norton? Pico, too. Man, this this town is just full of goats. Except they're not goats, they're amazing villagers. Damn it, really? Nook might have sold me some cheap crap. Ooh, I need that. 
I don't know what that was. That might have been a scare. <laughs> Alright, really good Emperor Butterfly, too. This run's really coming together right now. I really need these axes to last. The axes are the most important thing right now. Got the early Emperor. We are vibing. This could be an incredibly good run. It's all on these axes. And the coconut. The coconut has to show up, too. Okay, we have a giant beetle. Here for the Kirby runs, but playing Warfare. Warframe, sorry. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the lurk. Alright, please, 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 please. I need a coconut, dude. Please. This axe is beasting right now. Going beast mode. Okay, this is pretty dang good. I hope you enjoyed the Kirby. If you guys are enjoying the stream in general, feel free to follow. Love having you all here. Thank you so much for watching and being here. We're about to do a nut check, which literally means we're going to check the beach. Check the beach for a coconut, because we have to get a coconut in order to finish this run. I need to plant a coconut to get palm trees to get certain beetles. Not seeing it yet. Do have a giant and a scarab so far, though. Wow, that's so good. Pretty freaking good pace run here. Just wanted to survive. That's not a great axe. Okay, we'll keep those four trees. Alright, I don't think I have a coconut. I don't think there's a coconut. I knew there was something that had to stop this run from making it. Let's check this little sliver beach right here. Damn it. Dang it, dude. I was really hoping this wouldn't... This wouldn't be the case, but... It looks like this run is gonna die to a coconut. If I had a coconut, we would be on an incredibly good pace. I'm probably gonna have to get more axes anyways. We'll see. I don't think the axes are quite gonna make it. So I'll have to go forward anyways, but... It could have been. It could have been everything. Exactly. There is no purpose in durability in golden net. Golden tools. My auburn or redhead? No. Dude, I need the nut. Are you kidding me? Where is this guy? It's Harry, dude. He's stinky. All right, he'll have that flea no matter how long I'm out here. Holy crap, dude. This run is legit incredible. This might even be world record pace, if I had the nut. It might be on that little beach on the right, but I suffer to think it's there. I don't want to get my hopes up. If it's there, though, I'm actually on world record pace, literally. I'm not even kidding about that. This is effed up. Exactly shooting. However, the axes are falling apart. Holy moly, dude. Don't let me forget about that flea. Don't let me forget about it. There was a rainbow. I didn't even see it. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, dude. I 
Having the rainbow too on top of everything. Oh my gosh. That would have been too much for me to handle, I think. I just started falling apart. Freaking out. Got an incredible, incredible run for the front page here. Incredible run for the front page. Holy moly. And these axes are absolute garbage. What's up, Bob? Okay. No nut there. So we don't have a coconut. We do have a flea hybrid and incredible axe pace. Heck, man. Please let me through. Please give me a coconut. That's all I ask for. You can't get coconuts from normal trees, no. Oh my god, I got the oak silk tooth. What the heck, man? This is too good to be true. I really need that coconut, guys. I'm not even kidding. Like, that is so, 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 so important. I do not want to lose this run to not having the coconut. That would be the dumbest way to lose the best pace I've ever had. I would say this is the best pace I've ever had at this point. 8 of 12, early hybrid, early flea. Literally just need the coconut. Chop down the top right so I don't have to come back here. I think this is my last axe, right? I might have one more. No, I doubt it. I think this is my last one. So, gotta catch that flea. Don't forget about the flea. I already got that. Oh my gosh. This run is incredible. I do have another axe. Oh my god. Could have been done with deforestation of 45 minutes with a flea coconut hybrid. If there was just a no! 
coconut! I need the coconut, dude. Oh my god. I'm literally gonna lose my mind right now. It's so close to being the best thing I've ever seen. Just didn't get the nut. Oh my- With a flea! It's one thing to be deforestation at 45, it's another to do it with the flea. With the flea! Sub-50 still possible? Yeah. The only problem is I have to get another axe or two. Probably, preferably two. Uh, and I have to check the beach again and finish those trees to the right. So probably not sub-50, but still just amazing. I really need that coconut, man. I am gonna... I'm gonna go for, like, four or five days. I really want to be safe with this one. We'll get the other... We'll get the other axe on another day. Alright, I'm just gonna... I think that one axe will finish it. It's just that little... It's that little strip below the gate. That's the only part that I need to finish. Uh, that's literally it. So I'm just gonna go for it a few days. I'm gonna go, like, three days, I think. I'm gonna give it three days, I think. I, I want to be super safe. I don't want to... I, I could risk it all. I could risk it all. I don't know. God, dude. Come on, just please give me a coconut. I don't know if I want to risk it all. <laughs> oh, I really do. I really do. But I can't. I can't. Three days, two days, I don't know how far forward to go. <laughs> Raffalasia moment. Any reason not to go forward a year? Uh, the coconut only has one, like, spawn in chance, I guess. Per time. So if you go forward a lot, I mean, you're still only getting one chance for the coconut to spawn. That's why. Uh, okay, let's do a quick check. Just in case it's just the most extreme luck ever. Let's see. Sir, I'm gonna need you not to go in that pond. Please. <gasps> da! <Yeah! laughs> oh my god, dude! Oh, this run is sick. Yo, <laughs> nut. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. Yes! Yes! Holy shit! I rule. I rule. <laughs> oh my god! Somebody get the ambulance in here. <laughs> what the frick is going on? What is this run, dude? Where did this come from? Okay, keep your wits about you, gamer. It's not time to throw it all in the garbage can yet. Keep, keep your wits about you. You know what to do. Don't throw this. Got the tarantula too. Don't throw this. Don't throw this. Don't throw this. Don't throw this. Imagine early pedal tail with this. I might actually, I might actually fall apart. I might actually fall apart if there's an early pedal tail just randomly. I might actually fall apart. I might shit my pants. <laughs> I might crap myself. Okay. Explain. I rule. <laughs> Is
Is this world record pace? Yeah, technically. Yeah. Unfortunately, world record does get early pedal tail, so it saves five and a half minutes over this. So pedal tail has to be really nice this run. Oh my god, dude. I'm shaking. Ooh, should I do early July this run? I could do that. I got the Emperor, by the way, anyone who's keeping track. Emperor is done. Oh, God. I'm so nervous. What the hell, man? I literally can't keep myself from shaking right now. I'm not going to have another pace like this in a long time, so <laughs> this is it. This is it. Okay, so we need the Grasshopper, the Monarch, and the Red Dragonfly before we leave here. Got the Grasshopper, some Monarch, Red Dragonfly, and plant the Coconuts. That's what we need to do here. Keep an eye out for Walking Leaf. Keep an eye out for... Uh... Orchid Mantis, regular Mantis. Walking stick as possible on the trees. Walker Cicada. Sounds like a bunch of ground bugs. I might want to reset the, the map here. Violin beetle is another thing. And apparently the common butterfly, which I don't care about. Yeah, way too many weird bugs. I want to reset so I can get the monarch and the red. Monarch, red dragonfly. No, I, I won't cry for this. Also cookie. I forgot we had cookie in this run too. I did scare away a rainbow stag too. That's another unfortunate thing. I really want to see... Really want to see a walking leaf early if I can get something. I would choose a walking leaf. Oh, so much crap, dude. Come on. Orchid Mantis would also be sick. Also, I haven't seen a rare butterfly in September in a long time, I think. So seeing a rare butterfly here would be equally great. God, so much crap, dude. Come on. Monarch Red Dragonfly. This garbage everywhere. Come on. There's way too many freaking stupid locusts. <clears throat> yeah, it's my sub 50 Toadstool Tour run. Come on. Don't troll me, Red Dragonfly, and Monarch. Not this run. Dude, what is this? There's not a single monarch nor a red dragon. I've never missed both of them. God, that's so much time, dude. Just want to see them all. My best pace ever. Four minutes ahead of best pace ever right now. If I split right now. Pretty far ahead of best pace ever. It's freaking incredible. Just gotta piece it together, man. Come on. Stop trolling me and give me the goods. <sighs> so 
So many grasshoppers, monarch, red dragonfly, walking leaf, regular mantis. Take that. What is all of this? <laughs> this is all stupid. Oh my god, not a single one of either thing. The mantis is good, but orchid is way better. Damn it. <sighs> Six minutes is not a great split here. Six minutes is not a great split here. This is what happened to my best ever pace Roni too, but still got plenty of time to make it happen. Just getting trolled right now. It's not that bad though, because doing it this way actually gives me a lot of chances, opportunities to find rare bugs too. Because a lot of rare bugs can spawn right now. Um, now, they, now there's two monarchs. Classic. A lot of rare bugs can spawn right now, too, so I've, I'm technically giving, like, getting some opportunities at getting these rare bugs. Okay, fine, I'll get the turnips right now, too. So technically, spawn, spawn chances are happening. It's my partner. He's doing great. He's doing great. Playing a lot of Minecraft recently. Enjoying his time. I'm down here in the basement and he's up there, upstairs, having the time of his life with Minecraft. And friends. Oh, there he is. Okay, we're out. Not the best, but not bad either. Not that bad. That's pretty bad. Get mad! I would have been much, much happier. I would have been much happier with that if I got the walking leaf, but I didn't find that. So that's the one downfall there. All good. Let's keep going. You miss seeing his head in the background. Yep, that's true. That was a long time ago. He's up there and we're down here. And he's frozen in there. Where's the caveman? Muzz, I hope you're doing fantastically. Sorry, I'm on an incredibly good run. Until that September morning, this was like... It, it, I, this is still my best ever pace, by far. Uh, but, like... I, I was shaking. Like, that's how good that was. I'm still kind of shaky right now. I got trolled a little bit. We got the northern lights, too. What the heck? But, like, yeah, it's like, it's like that. <laughs> Where's the rock at? Oh, there it is. Boy, I'm glad he's frozen in there. And we're out here. Okay, so dung beetle, mole cricket, bagworm, pill bug, centipede. That is the gist of what we are looking for right now. Or the dung beetle first. Nice. Okay, dung beetle's out of the way. It's nice to have early. Pill bug is really easy. Centipede is hard. Centipede first. No, shut the hell up! Shut up! Oh my god, why is he there? He's never up here. So don't go up there. That's where he is. Wisp, shut up, challenge. Dude, first try centipede. Oh. <laughs> Mole cricket. Mole cricket. Uh, let's grab some white flowers early just in case. Uh, and bagworm. Pillbug, mole cricket, bagworm. That is such a weird combo. I never have that combo. Don't mole cricket last boss me, please. Okay, good.
We got bones, too. Look at these villagers, dude. Bones and all of these guys. Oh, my God. These villagers are cracked. These villagers are so good, too. Man, what the heck? All right. Let me get a bagworm. This is going to have a bees in it. Oh, no. There's my baggy boy. I just need a pill bug. Pill bug last boss. Oh, I need to plant the nuts, too. I almost forgot. Oh, my God. I almost forgot. Plant the nuts. That would have been really bad if I didn't plant them. I'm so glad I remembered. And pill bug is pill bug's super easy, so at least it should be. <laughs> Man, what a fantastic January on top of all of this. And we have the flea. Oh my god, please. RNG gods could make this happen right now. I'm not even kidding. I'm not even kidding. We'll check the rock near the museum next. Alright, that's good for palms. I only want seven of them. Okay, this should have a pill bug. Yep. This is disgusting. I rule. <laughs> I'm gonna go to June. I can't risk anything else. I just, June is all I know how to do. I think. Yeah. No. Yeah. Shoot, I don't know. I should go to July. No, screw it. I'll go to June. Let's do early June. Early June. Extremely, extremely unlikely to get a Rapalasia here. It would make no sense. It would make no sense if I have a Rapalasia. I didn't even go forward, like, any days in the early game. Like, I went forward half the days. There's no no sense of there being a Rapalasia here, so... We need to see some bugs to verify. See some bugs to verify. Make sure we're seeing bugs here. The moment I see a bug, then I will be at peace. If there are no bugs, then I have a Raffalasia. We know how to get rid of Raffalasias. I'm gonna buy that axe, actually. Actually. We know how to get rid of the Raffalasia. It's new tech. Recent new tech, actually. This is a safe net. I probably shouldn't do it. But it's fine. Just in case one of the axes breaks extremely fast, uh, it should be. It's a really good idea to have another one just to make sure I can clean up the rest of the trees. All right, so early June here. I already have the violin beetle. Not concerned with it. Okay, I hear a bug. Nice. We are safe, dude. So now we're gonna we're gonna uh, collect all the flowers here and consolidate them. What doing that does is what doing that does. Yeah, that's the right word. That's the right way to say that. What doing that does <laughs> is it allows me to isolate spawns to a, a particular area so that I know exactly where everything is. Darn or dragonfly. I know exactly where everything is and I can make spawns happen more quickly in a confined space. That's the idea. Okay, we're gonna leave this red rose here. Finish going around the island, catching all of these bugs. Oh boy. What's up, Tomas? Um... <laughs> I hope you're doing well. Very interesting, uh... Very interesting message entering chat. But I hope you're doing well. 
when I think about a pride stream, it kind of is. I mean, the other the other layouts I have actually have uh, like a pride border. Kind of weird speed run. You know it, Jetto. You know it. But this is the only an this is the only good Animal Crossing speed run. So let me sell you on that. Yeah. Did get Tony Hawk. Got uh, that. We need the we got the common and tiger butterflies. There are a lot of white flowers this time, which is very good. Giving me confidence. So we need the yellow butterfly. I'm gonna plant my peacock butterfly, or my peacock flower here. Just make sure. There we go. That's ready to go. We can get rid of this. I can't see that flower. It's behind a tree, so I don't need that. Now let's finish uh, gathering up the flowers here. Taking care of them. Uh, and then because I got the ladybug, I need a honeybee, which I saw earlier. I don't know what happened to it. I need the honeybee, the yellow butterfly. There's the honeybee. I need the honeybee, the yellow butterfly, and the peacock. And that's it. So peacock... And yellow butterfly. So the remaining two here. Need to get all these flowers. We'll only go backwards from this point on. There's so many white flowers, I can't even carry them all. Really good to see the ladybug already as well. Needs more gay. We'll just post Wowie Pot. Get some channel points to redeem it. There you go. Rainbow Pog Dog. I think that's pretty gay. White flower gaming, indeed. Here you go. Rainbow Pride Pog. I think I've got it covered. Also, there's the booty. I forgot about that. There's also the booty with rainbow shorts on. That's pretty gay, too. Oatmeal the cat says hello. This is going extremely well, yes. This is going incredibly well. World record machine, I doubt I'll get record with this. Getting record with this would inquire, would still require like the best luck ever from this point on. Which, you know, could still happen, it's just unlikely. I, I need like, the amazing luck I've gotten thus far needs to continue. There is a huge chance of me PBing. Keep in mind, there's 15 minutes between me... Between me and World Record. Like, I have so much PB time, too. I need that. There's so much time. Alright, the first day of July is the rainy day. Alright, we're done with the setup here, so now it's just Peacock Butterfly. That's it. Hopefully I can find some rare butterflies or an Orchid Mantis while I go for this. Um, we'll see if there are any there. Scare this guy in the river, spawn some more stuff. Okay, maybe not. Alright, let's see if we got any goods over here. The ladybug, that's it. Crate. This is so many flowers that I'm going to get rid of the... I'm going to get rid of this. These yellow flowers, I don't need them. Because I have too many flowers. Alright. So now, just get the peacock. I might put my turnips down for the ant and the fly, too, but I don't really need those yet. They'll happen. Oh my gosh, man. My goodness, this run's good. If I find those rare butterflies, that's one of the things that's in my way. Ain't okay, nothing there. Rare butterflies, so Agrios, Raha Brook, Birdwing, the Walking Leaf, the Orchid Mantis, uh, the Jewel Beetle. 
the giant petal tail and the scorpion. Those are the big ones left. Okay, nothing this time. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Speedo's at the pool? I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know what to think about that. Hope you're doing well, Didi. Hope you're doing well. Um, James, Hylian, anyone else who's coming in? I scared away an orchid! I didn't even see it, dude. Dude, what's happening? What's this going on? I didn't... I wish I saw that orchid. Did you see this shit? Oh my god. Birdwing, Raha, Orchid, Peacock, all in one there, and I scared away the Orchid. Dang it, dude. I didn't even see it. I was looking at the other shit. What the fuck was that? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. We're chill. We're chill, guys. We're chill. Okay, I might be shitting myself just a bit, though. Okay, calm down. We're good. Thank you for the gift sub. Steve-O went to KRS. Very good candidate. Thank you, Steve-O. It manifested, DD. What the hell did you just do? Why did I scare away that orchid? That might have been crucial. The orchid has lost me a lot of time before. Why is it raining? Why is it raining? It's the dry season. It shouldn't be raining. Why did I leave? Why did I leave? Okay, go back in. Why did I leave? Why did I leave? Why did I leave? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I don't care. I need it to rain. Okay, that was stupid. Pointless 45 second time loss. We're going back in. Sorry, I'm fr I'm literally freaking out. I don't know what's going on. I didn't even realize that rain's actually the best case scenario here. I just totally, f I totally messed up. <laughs> I was like, oh, why is it raining? Wait, rain's good. Rain's good. <laughs> I should have gone to the July 1st day, too, because I know it's raining on that day in the morning. Okay, I completely screwed up, but we're fine. We're fine. We're back. Okay, walking leaf here is the largest thing that could happen. Somehow I missed this, these flowers right here. I don't know how I missed these flowers. Whatever. They're gone now. Okay. Walking leaf is necessary. I need the walking leaf here. And then I also have to get all the cicadas and the jewel beetle. So jewel beetle, cicadas, walking leaf. How did I miss this? Where did that come from? Okay, so jewel beetle, walking leaf, cicadas. Here we go. So robust cicada. Walking leaf control me out of my run still. That's why it's scary. Brown cicada. Niyama stag. Check the river for diving beetle. That is incredible! Okay. <laughs> okay, keep your wits about you. Ah. <laughs> uh, this run is. Uh, uh, there's two of them! <laughs> Why are there two? Michael Phelps. Oh my god, dude, please. Come on. Come on, gamer. What are you doing? Come on, don't troll me. There's freaking two of them, dude. What is this run right now? One of you come over here. Guys. Guys, please. There's two of you. One of you has to make your way over here. Maybe you? Good. Well, well behaved lad. Okay, now we need Walker Cicada and Jewel Beetle. Oh my god. <laughs> can't, I can't believe this is happening right now. Walker Cicada and Jewel Beetle. There's another walking leaf. I'm gonna crap myself. Okay, Walker. We'll get that fruit beetle as well. Just 
because why not? All right, just the jewel beetle, man. Jewel beetle is the most needed thing by far here. Jewel beetle, please, 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 jewel beetle. Saw stag. Okay, I'll take it. I don't know how I swung there. I need the jewel beetle. The snail will happen during the palm beetle segment. Don't worry about the snail. Is that another walking leaf? Okay, I'm just. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh, this run, dude. This run right now is something special. I don't think I'm gonna get a run like this in a long time. Okay, on to the palm beetles we go. Look at that, dude. This split. This everything right now. If I got that orchid, I would be... I would be... I, I don't know. I would be... All right, somebody check the robust. I caught a robust. I know I did. Uh, it's gonna head into an area of Saharan at Saharan dust, Saharan dust plume, Stevo. So that's why the National Hurricane Center is giving it a low chance of formation. The first day was raining, right? I should have just gone backwards on the 22nd. Good. Almost had a freak out there. Okay. Oh, good, Stevo. All right, here, uh, evening cicada, lanternfly, walking stick, snail, rainbow, dynastid, spider, and the palm beetles. And we're out. All right. So, a few things left on the regular trees, rainbow stag being one of the scariest. What's the first palm beetle gonna be, guys? Go ahead and guess. There's the rainbow. There's the stick. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what this is. This is legitimately stupid. First palm beetle. Guess it. This is literally idiotic, dude. I cannot believe this is happening. Okay, lantern fly. Spider. Gotta get the snail. Dynasted. Elephant! There's the lantern fly. Oh my god, dude. Why is everything lining up right now? Why is everything lining up? Why is this happening? Why are there two dine why are there two rainbows? No! Uh, why am I so stupid? On top of all of that, I'm an idiot. No! I needed that so bad, dude. I really do. I really did need that. That was an idiot moment. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Alright. Lantern fly, because I'm a dumbass. Oh my god, why did I do that? Why did that happen? Why are there three rainbows? Three rainbows, another scarab, another stick? It's okay, I wouldn't have spawned the spider in. The spider is not spawned in yet, okay? So there's no spider. Oh look, see, I got it right back. There's no spider yet, that's the problem. And I, the spider's the last thing I need on the regular trees now. This run is incredible. Oh my god, dude. I'm gonna fall apart at the seams. So I need a spider. There's another lantern fly. Damn, I really need to get rid of these trees. I guess we could check. Check for an early spider, just in case. I didn't get the golden. Whoever marked the golden, I don't have that yet. What? We got the spider, dude. <laughs> this is so good. Dang it. 
I thought I didn't spawn the spider in yet, but apparently I did. Or at least I had one to begin with. Alright, perfect. Regular trees are done. Look at that. Literally four rainbows. Four rainbow stacks. Look at my axe broke twice, so the safety axe is coming into play. Okay. Look at all these snails. Okay, Cyclomatus. So we need Goliath, El uh, Goliath, Golden, and Hercules. That's what's left here. Goliath, Golden, Hercules. There's the Goliath. Golden and Hercules. Those are the two hardest to get. Oh my god, dude. Let this happen, dude. I have so much time. So much time to make this happen. Nothing spawned in. My gamers. Uh, I don't know what's happening. Why am I not spawning anything? Okay, there's the hurt. Alright, just the golden now. Come on. This is still pretty damn good. I pulled the weeds. Actions to perf actions perform so things spawn in the meantime off screen. Instead of just running back and forth, there's a higher likelihood of things spawning like that. Perfect. Alright, we're out of here. This run is doable. Oh my god. That Tomas guy, yeah. Shouts to Tomas. Okay, so here, Banded Dragonfly. Agrios Butterfly, Orchid Mantis, and Longhorn Beetle, plus Ant and Fly on the turnips. That's what we're going for. Don't rain. Very good. Kiki getting the net out. I like that. I like to see that. Agrios is twice as common as Birdwing. We don't need to be near the water at all. There's another walking leaf, just for insurance. Banded. I screwed it up. Damn it. Okay, maybe he doesn't cross the river here. Okay, nice. Oh, somehow I missed. What? Okay, banded done. <laughs> That's good. Sometimes it can be a troll. Banded, we're looking for Longhorn. I'm gonna put my... Turnips down. Oh, the 
this dude's outside. Oh my goodness, Blur. <laughs> you were just in time for the run of my life. <laughs> oh my gosh, Blur. This is the run of my life. I'm not even kidding, dude. I scared away an orchid, but that was like the that's like the only thing. I'm literally choking <laughs> right now. <laughs> it's so good. I hope your stream was fantastic, by the way. Thank you, thank you. We had a great time. I still gotta... You know what? I don't... I gotta follow you. I'm an idiot. I don't think I've followed you yet. No orchid that time. I gotta follow you. So much streaming. That is a lot of streaming, uh, Blur. I hope you had a great time, though, because so much. We have boomies. That's what Sand and I call thunderstorms, by the way. Oh my god. I should sub to him. I should. What the heck's wrong with me? Okay, so yes, I'm, I'm in the middle of an incredible run. Please. 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 Okay. <laughs> No, get this out of here. <laughs> okay, ant and fly done. So literally all we have left here is uh, Longhorn, Orchid Mantis, and Agrios Butterfly. Oh, we've got time. We've got time to see him. We've got time, all right? Agrios, Longhorn, Orchid, please. Yeah, so the thing is... Blur, I got the flea, 8 out of 12 axes, early hybrid, okay? I didn't get the coconut. No nut. And I would have finished deforestation at 45 minutes. These are terms that make sense to Blur, of course. And some of you who have watched for a while. 45 minutes. So, and, and I, I needed another axe. I needed, like, 7 more trees. Incredible. Incredible stuff. And then I... I, so I went forward, I got an axe, exited out, and went another day forward, finished the trees, and then decided, what if in those two days the coconut showed up? And it did. And it did. So I got it. With the flea. And then... And then in June... Right at the end of June, when I was finishing up that split, I found two peacocks, a birdwing and a Raha Brook, and an Orchid Mantis, all on the same map. The same map. It took me like four in and outs of the house, but that happened. I saw the Birdwing first, so I didn't see the Orchid Mantis, and I scared it away trying to go for the Birdwing. Oh my god. Okay, that's fine. Just don't be an idiot. Okay, Orchid Mantis. I can't believe it. They agree I showed up. <laughs> Orchid Mantis and Longhorn. I don't need the Longhorn yet. I have plenty of times to get the Longhorn. When I go for the Scorpion, there will be Longhorns. So if I got that, if I got that Orchid, I would be out of here right now. I I could get world record if I get the Orchid. The Orchid would make this world record possible. I could get record if I get Orchid. There's another one, dude. What even is that? What even is that? I don't know how long I have to get world record. Uh, it requires a perfect petal tail and a perfect scorpion, plus moth, mosquito, longhorn. Yeah, that's it. Uh, so minute and a half, minute and a half, three minutes. I have like two minutes to get world record here. Are you kidding me? Three in a row? Please, please, orchid mantis, please. I should go to April right now, shouldn't I? I don't know. Might go to April. I have no idea. I should probably do it. <laughs> but if I could get three egg grass in a row, I could find an orchid. Yes! Oh my god! Don't miss this. <laughs> I could get it, dude! <laughs> oh my god. I could get it.
Please, just destroy the flowers, idiot. Get mad! It's all in the pedal tail. <laughs> the pedal tail, dude! <laughs> this could ruin my entire run. I might not even PB. This thing sometimes- it takes either a minute, five minutes, or 18 minutes to show up. It's all in this. This is it, dude. This is it. This is it. I have to get this thing. I can't- I can't not get this. That's the only option I have. Come on, man. Pedal tail, please. If it just, if it's outside my door, I could get world record. I literally could get world record if it's right outside my door. I don't think I'll be able to do this. I'm gonna choke on the scorpion, too. <laughs> I'm too nervous. Okay, come on. Okay, there's the mosquito. I'm not ready. I don't think they'll- I don't think the pedal tail's gonna show up, man, but if it does... If it does... This is the hardest bug to catch in the entire game. I don't think it's gonna show up. Immediately, at least. It might show up eventually, but like, immediately? Probably not. Okay, Longhorn. I need that. Pedal tail. Dude, I can't believe I have a chance at world record. Butch! What the heck is this town, dude? This is so cracked. Literally, Butch. All these villagers are so good. Okay. Come on, man. Manifest this piece of crap. Okay, I'm pretty sure I don't have it. I think I've counted 10 bugs, but I might have cycled one. Certain. Now I'm gonna go in and out. This deserves a map reset. If I find this thing, man. If I find this thing. Stop shaking, dude. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's the second one today. Tomas had a much nicer way of putting it, though. Well, if Jesus Christ gets me a pedal tail dragonfly right now, I'll tell you what. Then I'll repent. How about that? It's all up to Jesus. Give me a pedal tail. You heard me, Jesus. Alright, I think world record's dead. <laughs> Dang it. RN Jesus, yeah, exactly. I think world record's dead here. I mean, an instant scorpion might change it, but I'm pretty sure not. I'm pretty sure I can. Alright, that's about it for that. Damn. If only I got really nut, you never know. You never know. I like money. Not really, no. I don't make my stream about monetary incentives at all. Dude, that glitch in the wall. Did you see that? It made me react. Physically reacted to it. Alright, like I said, this thing could just straight up kill my run. It's totally possible. Come on, man. Oh my gosh, <laughs> don't troll me, please.
I don't want- I don't need money. No, stop. No. No! What's happening? Okay. I rule. <laughs> My god! <laughs> scorpion and mod. Dude, it's just a scorpion! This is so easy, dude. This is free. This is totally free. Thank you, Cowie, for the five gifts. I want sub 140. I want sub 140. Rip world record. There it goes, right there. Whatever. I could have done 340. That's... Uh, that was probably a mistake, actually. More villagers are, are asleep at 3.30 than they are at 3, so I should have done 3.40, but that's okay. Okay, it's all in this scorpion, dude. Rip the world record, man. But I, I gotta do this. I gotta do this. <laughs> Please, dude. Okay. We'll get the moth on the town hall. Actually, I should just go straight toward the town hall. Now, it's just in the scorpion. That's all we need. Keep close the ear out. This guy's awake. That sucks. Clear out the pockets. Why isn't that done? Why isn't that done? What happened? What's that? What is that? How? How did I not get that? What the fuck? <laughs> How did that happen? Common butterfly? Excuse me? I saw like 8 billion of them. No, the sub 140, dude! <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with that? How did I not get that? Dude, are you kidding me? Oh, God, I'm an idiot. The sub 140, I had it. Shit. Oh my God, dude. Dude. It's because I- no, it wasn't the checklister's fault. I said I had it. I said I had it. I said I only needed the yellow. That's my fault. That is my fault. 100%. Dang. What? Both red? Come on. That's stupid. Yeah, thank god that wasn't world record. You are so correct. You are so correct. You are 100% on the money there, my friend. 
Oh, I had a flower in my head the whole time, idiot. <laughs> oh my god, you cannot be serious. <laughs> the common butterfly. Oops. Forgot to split there, because I lost my mind. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. <laughs> That's a moment. Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh, man. Nah, that, that's it. No, no. I think I'm done with this category. That was what I wanted. I, I'm happy with it. I could have got sub 140. I don't care. This was the level of run that I was going for. I don't think I can do it again. I don't think I could do it again. I think that's it. I want to see someone else beat this, you know. You know, Drew... Shoutouts to Drew, world record 136. I actually had a shot at that. It's the only time I'm ever going to have a shot at that, really. That was... I've been doing this for over three months. Three and a half months of this run led to this. It took that many runs to get a run like this. That actually all came together. <laughs> yeah, and for that reason, like, I just... It, oh my gosh, trying to get another one like that is just horrifying. That was really solid though, like, major shout- major props to Drew. This is the second best ever run done of this category, of course. Um, yeah, just- just great. Just lovely. This- I want to see someone else beat this too. <laughs> Brilliant. Thank you so much for all the GGs, too.